एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल दिस इज द पार्ट टू ऑफ इटली व्लॉग फ्रॉम द रोलिंग हिल्स ऑफ टस्कनी वी हैव कम टू द दियाटिक स्ट्रीट्स ऑफ नेपल्स chill day so far we haven't done much since we arrived but i have a pizza making class booked for the evening that i'm really looking forward to this was honestly a great experience we got to learn a lot about the ingredients the ratio the dough the sauce and a lot of techniques we didn't feel rushed at all We learned a lot about the authentic Naples style pizza but also had a lot of fun at the same time. Oh, and we all got a diploma certificate at the end. Morning. Today's agenda is to visit the Pompeii ruins first, and then we'll go back to the city and roam around. By the way, what's with this weather? It's bloody hot. I'm wearing a light jumper, and I'm sweating. Pompeii Archaeological Park features the ruins of the ancient city of Pompeii that was destroyed by the catastrophic eruption of Mount Vesuvius. Here are the few things to know before you plan your visit to Pompeii. You have two direct trains from Naples to Pompeii. The Circum Vesuviana train stops right in front of the park entrance, which is very convenient but can be a little crowded. On the other hand there is a metropolitan train which stops a little further away from where you would have to take a 10 15 minute walk to reach the park but it's more comfortable and less crowded Book the tickets online beforehand so that you can skip the line and save some time I would also highly recommend a local guide as there are no much information available at the site So unless you have done your homework it can all be a little overwhelming for you also the park is huge so it would be difficult to navigate if you are not familiar for the same reason wear comfortable shoes and clothes i visited in peak winters and i was sweating the entire time also don't forget to stay hydrated We are here to enjoy the best panoramic views of Naples and also hoping to catch a good sunset.
nothing like a beautiful sunset after a long tiring day. And now it's finally time to capture the essence of Naples. Starting with Toledo Metro Station, which is one of the most beautiful stations in the world. Right outside the station, you have the bustling neighborhood of Spanish Quarters or Quartieri Spanioli. As we continue to walk through the historic center of Naples, we visit the narrow crowded main street, Spaccanapoli. And then move on to Via San Gregorio Armeno, also known as the Christmas Alley. It's one of the oldest streets in Naples and is full of local artisan shops. I wished I had more space in my bag. another day ends in the city of Naples with this gorgeous view. The vibe in Naples was completely different than what we experienced in Tuscany. And I think that's the best thing about travel. It makes you appreciate the calm and also the chaos. And on that note, and with this final view from my room, I am going to end this vlog. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. And I shall be back very soon as we continue to travel through South Italy. Bye.